Yo, what is going on people? Welcome back to the channel. I hope y'all are doing well out there. Now, I know I just recently gave you an office tour of the space and showed you around not too long ago. However, as someone who works from home and I spend a lot of time in this room all day, every day, I tend to look around and I start to see opportunities for improvement. So I figured I'd update you all on some office upgrades. Let's get into it. Now this is definitely overkill, but my first major upgrade to the office was swapping out my regular secondary desk for a motorized one that truly complemented my main setup. FlexiSpot was kind enough to send out their E6 motorized sit-stand desk, and it has truly been an awesome addition to the office space. Now first off, it is pretty easy to put together. It was delivered in two pieces, so one package for the tabletop and another package for the motorized desk frame, but it does come with all the necessary parts and even some tools to put it together and it even comes with some really nice cable management options to keep things tidy underneath the desk. Now the model I'm using is the 55 inch by 28 inch model with a white desk frame and this beautiful eco-friendly bamboo top which actually worked out perfect for my aesthetic. But even if my office aesthetic was different, the FlexiSpot E6 offers many flexible customization options to match a variety of different spaces. And I know this might seem like a small thing, but it even comes with wheels, which have been super helpful for helping me move the desk around for multi-use purposes. Now, like I already mentioned, the tabletop is made of that eco-friendly bamboo wood, and it is one whole piece, but I have to admit, it's a little bit thinner than what I'm used to because I'm used to getting Butcher Block from Home Depot and putting that on all my desks. But even so, the tabletop on the E6, it's really strong. In fact, the whole desk as a whole, it's really strong and sturdy. Even with the wheels on, I can bump up against this thing and it virtually has no wobble to it. And pairing that sturdy frame with its powerful dual motor three-stage legs, the E6 can hold and withstand up to 352 pounds of force. Now, I've only been using this desk for about a month now, but I can honestly say it definitely seems durable enough to stand the test of time. And even if it doesn't, FlexiSpot does offer a 15 year warranty on the E6, so it really gives me peace of mind knowing that if something breaks and goes wrong, I'm covered. So all in all, the FlexiSpot E6 is a pretty good motorized sit-stand desk. And the good news is, FlexiSpot is actually running a sale for it for Amazon Prime Day. So if you're in the market for a good motorized sit-stand desk at a really good price, you might wanna snag one of these bad boys. If you're interested, I'll go ahead and leave my affiliate links down in the description or pinned comment, and you can check it out for yourself. Now, having good motorized standing desks has definitely been good for helping to improve my ergonomics and posture, but even so, working a desk job doesn't naturally lend itself to helping me stay in shape, especially when I have a day full of Zoom calls or if I'm just doing heads down working sessions in design, photo editing, or video editing. So I ended up picking up this walking pad from Amazon. Now it pretty much works straight out of the box. No real setup required, just plug it in, turn it on, start using it. And what I like about it is that it does come with its own little remote for easy operation. It is space saving, so it tucks away really nicely underneath my desks. And speaking of that, it does come with wheels so I can transition it fairly easy between my desks. It is relatively quiet. I think the loudest sounds it makes are the beeps it makes when I'm dialing it up to my desired speed. And overall, I've been using this thing for about a month and I have noticed that I am feeling more energetic throughout the day. I am being more active and it even kicks that post-lunch sleepiness, or as I like to call it, the itis. So overall, I'm gonna continue using this thing in order to help facilitate a more active lifestyle, even while I'm working. Now this next upgrade, I have to admit, it's a little niche, but it's been something I've been wanting to get into for a while now. From time to time, I find myself needing little bits and bobs and attachments for my camera gear that have been super hard to find on their own. So, with a little inspiration, I decided to 3D print them. So I got a 3D printer. Specifically, I got the Kiti XSmart 3 from Amazon. Now this thing is awesome for two main reasons. One, as far as 3D printers go, it actually has one of the smaller footprints you'll see in a 3D printer. It takes up about the same amount of space as my regular printer. 
Now two, it is really fast. I have heard countless stories of people doing print jobs and it takes upwards of two, three, four, five hours and beyond. But for me, everything I've printed has been at an hour or less. And so I'm able to print, adjust, print again, adjust, print again, and it's relatively quick for me. So that's been super helpful. Now, aside from those two main things, it has an attractive design. It does light up and it does have those nice glass windows so that you can watch your prints. It comes with its own thumb drive so you can store all of your print designs, but it also does have its own Wi-Fi capabilities and its own printing software. So you can send print jobs directly from your computers to the printer and it works just fine. This has allowed me to print so many useful things that I haven't been able to find, such as a filter adapter for my OnePlus Open. I have been waiting months to get one of these so I can put an ND filter and attach it to my OnePlus Open, but manufacturers aren't making it. So I had to take matters into my own hands and this has come out so good. And with online resources like Thingiverse, I am definitely excited to see what else I can print for my needs. Finally, to round out the office upgrades is this nice little corner bookshelf that I picked up. Now it mainly holds some of the design and photography books that I've accumulated over the years because I would like to revisit them in order to gather inspiration. But it also holds my Fuji cameras, my Fuji lenses, and it has even served as a nice little B-roll station. And you may have seen some of the shots pop up in previous videos. But yeah, y'all, those are the office upgrades and uh, I think my office setup is done for now. If you liked any of those items, I will have affiliate links posted down in the description and pinned comment for you to go and check them out. If you liked this video, go ahead and give this video a like. If you haven't subscribed already, please subscribe. Go ahead and click that notification bell to stay informed on any future content. And until then, I will catch y'all later.